look at this. This morning, Buck had some errands to run, so uh, it's been a few years since I've sprayed. Um, like riding a bike, it'll all come back to me. I actually got it figured out already, I think. Uh, got my mapping figured out here. Yeah, it may not have been two years, but it's been, I know it's been a year. All right, I was gonna show you guys this. So, you know, as we're spraying, constantly looking out, and I noticed I have a tip. Maybe this one right here. That is dripping. Yep. I don't know if you can see in there or not. There is a... Right there. That's what you have to watch for. That's what we fought. I'm not sure what chemical that is left over. But you get that <clears throat> you get that down in these tips and it just messes with the pattern. And uh, it doesn't work. So it'll either mess with the pattern or it'll plug it up. But that's you just gotta keep an eye on that. So alright, that was an easy fix. Get back at it. But I think I got her figured out. Just in time. Buck called. He's on his way with the trailer. So uh probably get him switched back switched out. Get him back in here. So Yeah, it's enjoyable. But anyway, really laying down a nice pattern this morning. Just falling right in, so nice day out. Gonna be another hot one in the 90s, so. My relief. All right, back to co-op I go. Uh, got him switched out, so he got his errands ran. So should be good. We'll go get refilled, and uh, I think that area down there we're spraying. We will need one more fill, and uh, then we'll have to look at my sheet to see what field we want to go to next. Okay, I think that's gonna do it for today. Uh, another pretty good day of spraying. Uh, a little over 500 acres again. And I don't know what we lack, probably three, 300 acres or so. About another day, half day or so, we'll be finished up with fungicides. So I doubt I'll be filming too much next couple days. We got, my son is graduating, so 
We gotta get ready for all that good stuff. You know how that goes.